It was a long time ago. Far away. Dragovich, Stein, Krachenko, all must die. Hey fellas, we have some news for Black Ops Cold War and, well, things are not looking good. Yesterday was the PS5 reveal event and most of us were expecting to see, well, just about anything for COD 2020, but, well, we didn't get what we expected. Instead, just about every leaker, like insider and even journalist, came out to break us some bad news. The most important thing we have is an update to the leaked trailer situation from a couple of days ago, right? Because if a trailer leaked, we would expect to see it literally any day. Now, every person which has apparently seen this trailer and is like hinting at what they have seen, they all talk about this singular frame or like image, this still of the trailer. And of course, the trailer itself has not surfaced, so the, the image that people keep referencing it seems to be someone holding a shotgun in an airplane hangar and on the left side of the screen, I'll put up some recreations, uh, is like some fire. So since everyone keeps talking about this same singular frame, I'm now pretty sure that the trailer didn't leak, but maybe uh, just an image did or like, I don't know, definitely not the whole thing though. And here we have Long Sensation saying that the leaked alpha gameplay from last week is not like old stuff. That apparently is where the game is at right now, which is really, really worrying, but don't worry because there's a good update to this. Because the gameplay that we saw is, I mean, like, I don't know, a couple of years behind schedule or something. The best way I would describe it is like looking at a work in progress custom zombies map or something where you can tell that things are just not where they should be. But the gaming revolution said that he had seen some stuff recently, perhaps of the same map, which looked very different and a lot better. So I guess all we can do is hope that what that gameplay showed is not how far Treyarch, like how far behind Treyarch actually are. Now, the next big thing I want to talk about is this tweet from Jason Schreier saying not to expect a reveal anytime soon because this isn't some rando like on like on a Reddit or Discord claiming to have inside sources. This is one of the most like respected and biggest gaming journalists who has leaked so much inside stuff about COD. And we are gonna keep piling on the shit because it doesn't stop. So Long Sensation also says that he has heard time and time again that the game is a mess, behind schedule, not where it needs to be, and he thinks there's a 50-50 chance it could be delayed. And what I'm thinking is, if it's going to be delayed, like, surely it would have already. Surely Activision would have already made that decision. Like, if that alpha footage really is how far behind Treyarch are, there is no way this game is going to be anywhere near done by the time it should launch. Like, And we know that Modern Warfare 2 Remastered multiplayer has been worked on, so I'm just thinking, why not release that, you know, continue... Uh, like supporting Modern Warfare Warzone and Modern Warfare Multiplayer Remastered, Modern Warfare 2, sorry, and just delay this game for a considerable amount of time so that it doesn't, so that it just doesn't suck, like, I don't know, under normal circumstances, Treyarch make amazing games, but this is no ordinary or normal circumstance. And finally here, the Black Ops reveal is looking like beginning to mid-July, so still a while away if it's not delayed any further. And of course, we know the easter egg and the storyline and all that kind of stuff in Warzone is leading up to a Black Ops reveal. Like, loads of different sources are reporting that, like they are directly connected. And also, like people have said, that doesn't look like it's going to, as TGR said, reach a climax anytime soon. It looks like that's going to be dragged out for quite a while. Like, we're going to get these little teasers here and there, like the RCXD stuff, the red phone stuff, that hint towards Black Ops... And we're going to have leaks coming through, but it looks like, I don't know, this game is just maybe the weirdest scenario I've ever seen. Well, in COD at least. Anyway, fellas, that's all for today. Yeah, things aren't looking or sounding too good. And also, we do have some other news, some other bad news coming up, <laughs> like tomorrow probably. So be on the lookout for that. Stay spicy, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.